Setting fence posts is the first and most important step when you're installing a new fence. Set your fence posts straight and sturdy to ensure the rest of your fence is properly supported. Consider asking someone to help you with the job. Set up mason's lines with string and wooden stakes at equal intervals to outline the placement and direction of the fence. Mark the spot for each fence post by hammering the stakes into the ground. Setting fence posts involves a lot of digging, so consider using a power auger or post hole digger. They're easy to use and will lighten the workload considerably. For proper support, fence posts must be set 6 inches below the frost line or at least half of the exposed height of the post. The width of the hole should be at least 4 inches wider than the fence post to accommodate the concrete base. Use clamshell post hole diggers to remove any rocks or stones that obstruct the placement of the fence post. Once the hole is deep enough and clear of obstructions, pour 4 inches of gravel to form the base. Use the fence post to lightly tamp the gravel down flat. Reattach your mason's lines to reposition the post. Attach a length of wood to the post and stakes to form a basic support brace holding the post upright while you position it straight. Use a level to ensure the fence post is perfectly vertical. You want to get this right before the fence post is set in concrete. Pour concrete mix into a wheelbarrow or bucket and add water. Use a shovel to form the concrete compound. Add more mix if necessary until the water is well absorbed. Work the concrete continually to ensure it doesn't harden in the wheelbarrow. It should be about the consistency of oatmeal. Pour at least 6 inches of concrete on top of the gravel to properly support the fence post. Use a 2x4 to tamp the concrete down about an inch below ground level. Check again that the fence post is straight before the concrete dries. Allow the concrete to fully harden before backfilling the rest of the hole with soil. A strong fence starts with well-set posts. More saving, more doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. Here's a reminder of the tools and materials you'll need to complete this project.